Dark Lord knows I serve him, Bellatrix. Then swear to it. Make the unbreakable bow. Will you, Severus Snape, swear to watch over Draco? Will you swear that if Draco fails, you will carry out the Dark Lord's orders? I will. Hi, Ginny. Harry, you've been chosen. You're Gryffindor Quidditch captain. I knew you'd get it. You've not flown all summer, though, so you'd better get some practice. Come on, Mr. Chosen One. You can use my broom. Thanks. should be around here somewhere. I'll see you later. Look, honestly, Ron, all we need to do is clean them out. You could have done it already if you hadn't had a fourth helping of dinner. When did you get here? About half an hour ago. Didn't Ron tell you? I would have, but you've not let me get a word in. If you'd done these jobs for your mum, I wouldn't have needed to speak to you. Mum was to get rid of these cauldrons Fred and George had left in the garage. I'll give you a hand. Oh, oh, that one smells far worse than the others. That's it. Well done. Oh, no. Moving them must have stirred everything up. Quick! Chuck them in the pond! You can't throw them in there. Safer than washing them. Who knows what Fred and George mixed in there? Exactly. Just think of the... the fish! 
Fish. <laughs> well, I don't know what happens if a fish swallows love potion. Do you? Maybe they'll fall in love with you. Hermione, boop, boop. I love you, boop. Oh yes, Ronald. How very grown up of you. Come on, Harry. Let's get rid of those cultures before Mum starts moaning. Wingardium Leviosa! That was brilliant! Wish we could do this after every potions lesson. You did cast that quite well. Great! Let's get rid of the rest of them. Good shot! If the garden gets filled with lemon, it's Brilliant! Mum would have made us clean those out by hand. We'd have still been scrubbing them at Christmas. If you just take the time to learn some cleaning spells. Who wants to spend their time cleaning things up? This was much more fun. <laughs>